Hey guys, welcome to the quick video of how to use Sensible's Option Trade Analyzer. This helps you analyze your option trade for any given target on any given expiry date for your choice of underlying. First, I choose an underlying stock or index. I'm choosing Nifty here. Next, I choose the expiry, this one or the next one. So in Nifty, we have enabled two expiries, the current month and the next month. For Bank Nifty, it's going to be current week and the current month. For all stocks, we have given just one expiry, which is the current month, because the second month is not really liquid in most stocks and you don't want to get into illiquid options. Next, I choose the strike for call output. I don't have to specify if it's a call output because we give you both. So let me just go with the ATM. Next, I choose the target price of the futures on my target date. So this is important. You do not enter the target on the underlying stock or the underlying index. You actually enter the target on its futures so let's say nifty is at 10 4 23 future as you can see right here my target will be on the nifty futures itself so let me just quickly enter 10 500 or something and then i enter the target date let's say friday and finally i give my target time as 3 30 or whatever i want to do it is not really important to choose the target time because it won't really matter unless you're trading very very close to expiry so now i have the analysis block this is the option you've chosen here's the call here's the put this is your target on the future this is the number of days to expiry on your target day and this is the implied volatility of the option you have chosen as on that date so this number is usually filled by us you don't have to worry about what the iv is going to be on that day here you can see the pnl on a call buy and a put sell i can change this buy or sell using this toggle right this is the expected price of the option on the day of my target and this is the last traded price of the option. Now, this part is the analyzer, these three sliders. By changing these numbers here, that is the future, the date and the IV, I can see the change in my PNL. Right? So that gives you an idea of what your trade is going to look like at various market conditions. Finally, we come to Greeks. Now, Greeks is not really that important unless you are a very pro option trader because everything you have to do with the Greeks, we have already taken care of in the sliders itself. But let's just go with it and see what it's about. Here you can see Delta, Theta and Vega on your call and put options as on today. Now, this is per option. If you want to see it per lot, you can actually click here. Now, we have our option price. Delta, Theta and Vega per lot. Right, so that's a quick intro. I hope you have fun with it.